Welcome back. Today we're talking with people who've succeeded at a challenge they've set out for themselves and others. And they have proven that some people say a mission is impossible. They said, no, 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 it is possible. Back with us is fashion designer and activist Aurora James, who's helped Black-owned businesses with the 15% pledge she initiated. And that's just one of Aurora's successfully completed missions. Another was the launch of Brother Veli's. The luxury accessories brand celebrates African artisans and design practices that she studied extensively. Aurora, as I know, um, Beyonce has worn uh, your shoes, uh, you know, Nicki Minaj, the list goes on and on and on. But the reality is you were met with some resistance by the fashion industry when you took on the conversation of African artisans and really wanting to highlight some of the practices um, of luxury goods and, and how they are made and, and the representation of African artisans. Yeah, absolutely. You know, it's really fascinating because for so long, I think the fashion industry has really, you know, used Africa as a content a continent, as a source of inspiration, right? And not really involved those artisans in the process of making things. And I think for me, that's actually the most beautiful part. Um, growing up, I, you know, was fortunate enough to be able to travel a little bit. And when I wasn't physically going places, I was definitely going places in my imagination. And, you know, watching things on TV and reading National Geographic and really falling in love with so many different types of um, artisanship around the world. And for me, I just really wanted to involve artisans from you know everywhere across the globe in the process of creating luxury fashion and and really make the process and the work and the culture be what defines the luxury proposition for the brand. I love it. And so as a result of you investing in that way emotionally, spiritually, intentionally, we've seen so many people rise to your point. Countless black business owners have cited you and the pledge for getting them in rooms that they might not have been in without the success of the pledge and the mission that you saw as, as being possible. One of the brands is, was it 54 Thrones. Um, mm -hmm. Their products are now in Sephora. And we actually have a little bit of a surprise for you. Take a look. 54 Thrones creator Christina Funke Tegbe is with Hi. us. Hi. Hi, Christina. Welcome to Hi, the party. Hi. I wish we were all in the same room together, but the love is real. Can you share with us what a difference maker this pledge was for you? Yes. Hi, Aurora. Hi, Devin. I remember where I was when I was on Instagram uh, scrolling and I saw Aurora's post. And as soon as I saw it, I got so excited because I just knew somehow 54 Thrones was going to be a part of this movement that Aurora started. Um, and it did. <laughs> um, the 15% pledge helped 54 Thrones with visibility. Um, my brand is not a new brand. We've been around for six years now, but no one had heard of us, right? And so with Black Lives Matter and all the movements that were going on with George Floyd, and then when I saw the 15% pledge, that is really what helped us gain visibility, helped retailers begin to seek us out. And so I want to thank you, Aurora. Aww. Oh my gosh. Wow. That like, first of all, I'm such a huge fan of yours. Your products are amazing. I literally can't live without them. So the <laughs> idea that like the rest of America now gets to experience your product is so huge, honestly. And that's really what it's about. Like, these are some of the best businesses across the country, Tamron. And they've been excluded yeah. because they just haven't had opportunity and access. And I'm so proud of the 15% pledge and the over a dozen women that are working there now every day, one of the fastest growing nonprofits in America at all of this work that we've been able to do. and. Let's also give it up for the companies that have actually taken the pledge, yeah. right? And have yeah. stepped up and said, hey, we're willing to be accountable to this in a really long-term way. I love it. I love the accountability. I love that it's not just for the moment, right? We can all go on and do a hashtag and then that fade into the wind. But these are long-term commitments to phenomenal brands like yours, Christina, and like the many others. So somebody said... Take on the mission. Aurora said, I will, and you have made it possible. Congratulations, Christina. And of course, congratulations, Aurora, on everything. I love it. Aww. Well, thank you so thank much. You. I appreciate you having us on. This is an amazing, Tamron. Oh.